At 700 pounds and 20 feet high, we've been building one big ass rocket. What are y'all doing? Yeah, good morning. Hey, morning. Hey, guys. We did pretty good yesterday. Yeah, I'd say we. We got the fairing on for the capsule and the coupler. We put the parachute box in. We got the fins on. So we need to focus on getting the engines done. I'm hoping by about 3 o'clock or so today we can do a, a, a pyro test to make sure that we can blow Pyro the, test? Yeah. Well, we're going to burn or blow up? We're going to make sure we can blow the chute out and the nose uh, cone off. Well, we got to talk about how do you keep this rocket upright so we can get ready to launch the thing. Uh, do, do we stand it up and, and take a chance on all that weight breaking the tail fins off of it? And we concluded that it probably would break the tail fins and collapse the rocket. So we got to have a stand. So one of Roger's friends had a, a big old access ladder to, to a big tank. And we're, we're making a, a rocket launch stand out of a, probably a fertilizer tank access ladder. Uh, hey, we're innovative. We have to use what we can get. <laughs> High tech rednecks, that's what we are. This rocket is not like going out in your backyard and putting a little model rocket together and watching it you know, fly up and come back down. We've got to stand an 800 pound rocket up in addition to the platform itself, which is going to weigh several hundred pounds. Here we go, one, two, three. Catch it, catch it, catch it, catch it, catch it. Well, come on. Well, we decided to do a test. So we got the capsule in the backyard and we made our charges. And what we used is, was two ounces of black powder, one ounce each and two different charges. And then we uh, sandwiched on top of that the 19-pound parachute pack simulator. And uh, this was nothing more than a backpack loaded with bricks that weighed the same amount as a parachute. Grab that backpack. Because we didn't want to blow up the only parachute we had if something went wrong. You got it. My family's egg astronaut got injured because our parachute didn't deploy. So believe me, I know how important this test is. Now, you capturing the gunpowder where it can compress? Yes. How many shotgun shells you say it was worth, Daddy? 2012 and 14. <laughs> well, maybe it'll be enough. I got behind a tree. I've seen black powder blow up before, and it scares me to death half the time, and I shoot it all the time. Y'all get ready, get the duck. Fire in the hole, fire in the hole. Right behind you, Travis. Thanks, Pete. Three, two. Nice. That was cool. Did, it did, did its job. So we we're, were satisfied with the test. It's probably going to do great in uh, inner space. 